Good morning everyone, we're playing some more Mega Man Maker, most popular levels here, and I stumbled upon Yamato Man Comes Home by Gigar, and I thought it was pretty cool, so I wanted to showcase it. It will make, it will make for a nice, short, breezy, slash, cool, uh, little Saturday video here. Yeah, it is text edited too. Like, this, this level is... Well, it is, I almost said plain, but it's not plain. It's very simple, but like gorgeous at the same time. I IMO, IMO, like we have the text edited shadows, like the text edited pillars, like it's very simple, but very well made. Um, yeah, very cool level. That's mainly why I wanted to showcase it. Oh yeah, and if you pick Mega Man, you can go through here and take an alternate path. But yeah, I was about to say, it's almost a shame that like this level didn't make it to the first spot there. I think, honestly, that it deserved more recognition than it got, but you know, all the most popular levels like right now... Yeah, they have pretty much around 400 upvotes, 200 to 400 upvotes, so it's very hard to make it onto the first page there, if not impossible right now. <laughs> yeah, even though this had 42 upvotes, it still doesn't get the first page. That's just insane, the state the queue is in right now. Like, yeah, it's pretty cool, actually. Oh, well, we made it through that just fine. And yeah, this here is pretty cool as well. We have the robot chickens here. Gonna make short work of them. This one is a bit trickier. Like, these eggs, like... Yeah, they're kind of hard to deal with. Um, Roll is not the best at taking care of, you know, these small guys here. Sometimes they bypass you, but yeah, if you just keep... If you don't jump too high, that shouldn't be an issue there anyway. I noticed when I played this the first time around. There we go. Roll on straight through here. And I believe we have the... Yeah, the grasshoppers are right here. Yeah, pretty cool, very Mega Man 4-esque, if you will. And yeah, this jump here is kind of nasty. Um, I don't think we can make it easier on ourselves, so we're just gonna have to... Do it to it. Mm -hmm. Okay, I took the down path last time, so we're gonna go up here this time around. And I'm not quite used to those guys either, like, just yet. Uh, they go a bit farther than the... I think that's the Mega Man 5 purple, you know, flying guys there. Well, I think those camera flying guys go one tile further. Oh well, let's just see here. Uh, I'm just gonna do it this way. <laughs> that jump look, looked very freaking scary back there. And I love these enemies too, like... <laughs> they are quite tricky to dodge, but yeah. There we go. And that's pretty much it, and you know, once again, I didn't really talk much about it, but like, once again, the visions, like, I love how Gigar, like, had these rectangles in the tile work here, like, yeah, very cool looking. And here we have Yamato Man, and hopefully I can display some skill here with Roll. Like, yeah, see, this is why I like her so much, like, how she can pull off combos that other characters can't, I mean, just look at the damage she gets in. Whoops, jump too short. And of course the roll is amazing as well. Whoops. Nice, nice. Yeah, look at that, like, she's so clean at taking out bosses, like, it's so much fun to use her. So much fun. And cute. 
<laughs> yeah, definitely my favorite character. Like, she's dealing truckloads of damage. She's fun to dodge with. And yeah, she's a boss slayer. I mean, yeah. Roll is definitely the coolest character. Like, yeah. Bess and Proto Man has nothing on her there, in, you know, with the optional characters. That's just. That's just the way it is. <laughs> but yeah, a um, pretty cool level all around. This will be a pretty short video, but yeah. I'm gonna head on here. I'm gonna have some uh, company soon with me here. So yeah, I just wanted to make sure we had uh, a video going up here during Sunny Day. And yeah, I thought this would be a cool stage to showcase. Like a very nice level made by Gigar. Nice visuals, um, pretty nice enemy placements. Like never felt cramped or whatever. The only thing I uh, felt perhaps could be elevated a little bit were the gimmick usage. Like we had a grasshopper segment but it felt a little bit you know too standard almost but like overall a solid stage definitely stands out above the rest I will definitely say so. Yeah very nice job Gigar so yeah. You know what actually let's see here. Okay we're back here again. Um. I took another stage by Gigar here instead, like, Forest of Night version 4 loaded for like, a very long time and I don't wanna play like an hour long stage, so yeah, we're gonna see how long this loads, if it's just a shorter level or if this is another very long one, I really just want a quickie to go, and, oh no, this is probably another very long one, what the hell Gigar? Okay, nice. This is probably a 50 or 60 screen level up, which I can deal with. Okay, Pharaoh man. And we have roll. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. And... Hidden goodies. Do we have more? Nope, that's it. Okay. Alright, there we go. Just cut that out, the backtracking and... On we go! Huh, interesting. So we have these guys here instead of the little serpent flies of Mega Man 4 that drop those little... Well, I don't know what they drop, but they drop some kind of missiles on your... Well, not missiles, but some kind of energy ball or whatever. But these guys are a nice substitute, I guess. Whoa! Calm down there, Ron. <laughs> Jesus, look at that! Boom! She doesn't give a... Give a fuck. <laughs> She's just wrecking everything. Look at this! Look at this! It's carnage! Roll. <laughs> you gotta... Yeah. <laughs> you gotta calm down a bit here. You're... You're too awesome. What? Oh! Whoops. Screw that up. And in the original level we have a Mimira standing here, not a crow, if I don't misremember completely. Yeah, same here. We have new enemies here in Gigar's level. Although who's to say this is a complete remake of the level? This is probably just a loose interpretation of it, if you will. Yeah, we have the nice text editing here as well. I don't think I pointed out that out earlier, but yeah, as you can see, we have the shadows and all of that good stuff. And what the hell, she hits behind her as well. Look, look at this. <laughs> she hits behind her. Whoops! Didn't see you there, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Very nice. Whoops, I thought I killed him there, uh, that's why I just rolled right into him. Once again, pretty much like the Yamato stage, like, this level 2 is very basic. If there's one thing I would like to see more from Gigar here, it's a little bit more 
gimmick interaction, you know, like this. It does get a little bit stale otherwise, even though the levels look incredibly well crafted in the visual department. Woo! Yeah, see, now it gets much more exciting here. Oh, dude, I almost... almost choked. That's right, we have the dust weapon in this game now. And it's been beefed up from Mega Man 4. <laughs> like, it was a good weapon in Mega Man 4, but now the shrapnel really hurts here. Actually, I don't remember. Do, did the shrapnel hurt in Mega Man 4? I thought... I think it did, doesn't. I think it, it just kind of acts as a... Well... I don't know. An animation. It's just... It's basic. Uh, it's basically just staring at Mega 4. Jesus, can I stop tripping over my words here? It's so annoying. But yeah, in this game, the shrapnel really hurts, and yeah, it, it's really fun to use this weapon now. Like, look at this. It's just crazy. <laughs> And that might be it. Another very cool stage here, if this is indeed the boss room. Which it is, okay. Yeah, the brew might not be the best weapon here. Unless he decides to stand still and charge. <laughs> Man. Dude. Yeah, if you if you put a boss to be weak against Roll or her normal weapon, like she she's gonna deal too much damage, like it's just absurd. But yeah, another very nice level of Yigar, and I reckon that will be enough for now. I don't have more time to sit around and play. I gotta get out and do some some chores for the day here. Oh, but then I will be back and I'll be playing some more by myself tonight. Course, but yeah. Oh well, um, very nice stage there, Gigar. Um, I definitely like the. Well, I don't know which ones. Mm, this level actually was a little bit more engaging than the Yamato level, but the Yamato level looked. I don't know, I thought that had some cool visual flair to it. This one did, of course, as well, but yeah, I guess whatever. Both, both stages were pretty darn good, definitely. In the IMO, so yeah. I'll just leave it at that, and thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video where we continue doing some more viewer-suggested or viewer-requested levels, so yeah, see you then!